uh, the Berlinale was founded in 1951. So in 1951, for people who doesn't know, Berlin was entirely destroyed. Berlin looked in 1951 a little bit like, unfortunately, Aleppo today in, 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 in Syria. And um, so the people have been completely depressed. The Second World War was just five years gone. They have been re-educated. They needed culture. Because people, maybe people can live without economy. It's quite complicated to live without money or to live without economy. But to live without culture, it's much more complicated because then there is no hope. Culture is always hope. The film, festival was dedicated to help the understanding of the different countries in the world so that they understand each other much better. The German word is Völkerverständigung, and it's a really old word, and it sounds pretty German. It's a German word. It also sounds German, Völkerverständigung, but it's a very nice word because it means nothing else than to try to be tolerant to people from other countries with other religions, with other philosophies, with other, with other lives. And it means also to accept diversity in the world because there are not um, better people and uh, not so good people. We are all the same people. Yeah. And we have to accept each other, otherwise we will not have peace in the world. And culture, and also especially film, is one of the, of the tool to, to, to understand each other much better, and I think this is what we are doing up to today. And especially of the history of the Berlinale, which is a, a little bit more political than maybe other festivals, uh, we have uh, we had this year a lot of films dealing with the problems we are facing in Europe, and maybe you he you know this here that there are millions of refugees are coming from the war zone in Lebanon, but also Turkey, also from Afghanistan, and especially also from Africa. Unfortunately, from 2001 to today, when I was as the director of the, the Berlinale the subject didn't change. I remember very well my first festival, I, which, which was under my directorship, was in 2002. And the film which won the Golden Bear was Michael Winterbottom's film about a refugee, a 14-year-old boy. The, the title of the film is In This World, which could we have today, it's his title too. The film festival is a little bit like, like where we are sitting here. And when we present films, then we open a window. And we open a window with the film and say, hey, look, this is how it looks in Tunisia. And so there is a big problem. But these people have all internet. These people have all telephones. These people have all Facebook. They know how it looks in the world. They don't want to live like this anymore. And it face big problems. And to understand this, you need a film. Either somebody tells you this, but the best thing is you see a powerful film to show you how the situation is. And then, if we are lucky, people change their mind about this. <laughs>